from the Queensland Air Museum. We're located on Pathfinder Drive in Caloundra. I was trawling through the internet one night and I found the Barnes Wallace site. And of course he's an amazing inventor, Barnes Wallace, with the bouncing bomb, the Wellington bomber, which even my father-in-law flew in. Um, and the tall boy and the Grand Slam. If you, get, if you think this is big at 21 feet, the Grand Slam was 40 feet and weighed uh, 21,000 pounds. Now, having approached Bunnings, uh, they s said yes, we'll come to the party with materials and they were very generous as a good corporate citizen and sponsor. And Men's Shed Coolum said, yep, we'll do it. And the result is now, well up. Our job at the museum, uh, when we get there today, is to start the finishing work and the skinning and ultimately it'll be painted and uh, it'll be displayed in the vertical position because that was their best impact oh, for the war. They, they reached 750 mile an hour impact speed after being dropped. I had a neighbour in um, uh, Twin Waters and he was a sergeant pilot on Lancasters and he said when he dropped the tall boy it went straight up 600 feet at Lancaster. So you can imagine uh, what a, I suppose, relief to straining rivets on an aircraft were. Um, they had to take all the turrets out, they had to take the armour plate out just to lighten the aircraft to accommodate this. Lord, what they did with the uh, Grand Slam being 40 feet long, and this is 21 feet long. So yeah, it's, uh, he's quite a creator, old Barnes Wallace, quite a creator. See you later, safe driving. Hope she don't explode. <laughs>